Welcome to our channel eTechnis. In this video, we will talk about how to create partition on Windows 11 slash partition hard drives. We will talk about the steps you have to use. So, watch the complete video. Take your cursor on Windows icon and do a right click on Windows icon. Now select Disk Management. Make sure that you do not select Healthy Recovery Partition or Healthy EFI System Partition. You have to select the driver from which you want to allocate the space. I am pretty sure you already know about it. Do a right click and select Shrink Volume. It could take some time, maybe between 5 to 15 minutes. Here you can see the options. Total size before shrink in MB. Size of available shrink space in MB. Enter the amount of space to shrink in MB. And total size after shrink in MB. Now, if I want to allocate 10 gigabytes, then I have to multiply the number with 1024. Let me show you. Click on Windows icon and type calculator. Open it. Let's type 1024 and multiply it with 10 and we will get the number to enter. Now, let's type 10240 amount of space to shrink in MB options. Click on shrink. All right, here you can see that we got accurate 10 gigabytes of unallocated space. Do a right click on select new simple volume. Click on next and again, click on next. Now here, select the letter you want to assign for you drive and click next. In the file system, select NTFS means new technology file system. If you have a FAT32, then change it to NTFS and leave the rest to default. Click next. Now click on finish. All right, here you can see that we have create the new volume. Now, let's check it. Click on File Explorer. Now click on this PC. Here you can see that we have new volume of 10 gigabytes with drive letter B. That's how you can create partition on Windows 11. If you are facing any error with your Windows 11 or Windows 10 PC, then visit our forums page of tezadvise.com and ask your question by attaching the screenshot of error message. It would be great if you subscribe our channel. Give a thumbs up if your problem got solved by following our steps. And don't forget to share your comments. That's all for today. Thanks for watching.